Today we are troubleshooting a truss reverser fault on the 737 MAX. We already replaced the truss reverser control valve module but that unfortunately didn't fix the issue. So let's troubleshoot further. Removing an excess panel in the nose wheel well and removing it. What we see here is a junction box. This junction box holds a lot of relays and we want to measure a particular relay that controls the truss reverser movement. It's this one. Here's the setup with the multimeter. We want to make sure if we pull the truss reverser lever that the voltage is coming through this pin. This is the lever in stow. And if we pull it, there's a voltage of 25 volt DC. And stowing it again and removes the power. So that's good. Looks like this relay is not working properly, so we fit a new one. Reactivating the truss reverser system. Reset of the circuit breakers. And an operational test. The test is passed and the truss reverser system is working again. But we are not finished yet. Because we opened a access panel in the nose wheel well and that is part of the pressure cabin, we have to do a leak check. This means pressurizing the aircraft to a certain pressure and leak checking it. The panel was leak free so all tests passed. Thanks for watching and see you next time.